over 30 points a game. And for Boston College, they're missing a key man today. A starting guard, Jay Heath, that's 13 points a game. He's out with a fever. Uh, right before Thanksgiving, students are gone. Uh, you don't want to check out before this game is over as we take a look at a nice steal. Getting him out of the game and his production. Felder trying to muscle his way inside as he's denied. Hamilton will knock that one down. But they are cold. They really are, and also Boston College limiting them to one opportunity. Oh, great job. Popovich rolling inside, and that is going to mean a timeout. Popovich, he can hit it from beyond that arc, too. Thornton slicing in. He'll draw the foul, and he'll be at the line. Took a good hit. I had Thornton so open because Popovich's ability to knock down threes that time, over hedge, and then Thornton, nice body control. Eyes were on the rim the whole time right here. Take the hit. In and win. Uh, hats off though to Stephen F. Austin. Oh. They look really good last night. Tremendous Weaver straight on. Will sink a two pointer. Felder out near midcourt. Shot clock down to 12. Felder, another freshman for the Eagles. Shot clock to seven. Thornton putting on the brakes and he knocks in two. Key for Boston College. They're being very aggressive in the passing lanes. That shut down Jimerson. Very good shooter and that's a three on target. Skip past that time, no help by Boston College. That's a wide open look. Thornton again on the drive. Boy, that's a tough shot. You see four and two coming in. Eagles have to do it without the guard Winston Tabs. Will miss the entire season. There's Popovich with authority. Question is, do you bring him back before halftime? Well, I think you don't want this thing to get out of hand. Obviously, two fouls, you don't want him to pick up his third, but. Uh, the way Boston College is getting to the basket, Jerome Robinson, Kai Bowman, those guys would be in their senior years, uh, arguably one of the best backwards in the country, not just ACC. Uh, those two guys are playing for a paycheck. Jimmy Bell's a great story, isn't he? The freshman who at one point weighed 350 pounds, and people were looking at him as an offensive lineman. Look at him hit the deck there to keep that one alive. Perkins in close. He drops in, too. Athletically, obviously, it does him a world of good. He's a lot more versatile, mobile, all of those things. He's better on his feet as Perkins launches and hits a three. Boston College has lost their momentum. Trying to get it back. Heron from the wing. He sticks a three before the break. Bell on Popovich. Working hard. In close for two. That was a determined basket. Talked about it. I think Teddy Valentine sometimes gets a bad rap. I think he does a good job communicating off screen and that time before half as we take a look at Derek Thornton in his head yep. let's go play some ball that's the way you do that great communication from the officials that one's gonna be tipped up and in St. Louis with the basket and off for Collins here's Goodwin trying to make a move banging inside on Hamilton and banks in two so St. Louis able to get there and tie up the game a couple of times. They did in the first half, too, but now they can take the lead, and they are going to. Well, on the stuff, Jacobs. Not too many people see often, but I think that communication during dead balls. Yeah. Popovich, yes. Give him two to tie the game again at 30. He has nine. Wing at French, Hassan French, trying to get another foul on him. Don't settle for jumpers. Entry pass for French, and that'll drop in. Jump shot from the wing, and that'll go in for Thornton as he will nail a three. Pass back out for Thornton, and he will set it up now for the Eagles. Popovich, a beautifully run play for two. In conference play, in points per game, rebounds, and also field goal percentage. A guy oh. by the name of Zion was in that group yeah. as well. Hamilton could not get that to go down. Here's Collins in transition. Here's Jimerson. Yes! He'll bury the three. Up with the turnover of versus the veteran, Derek Thornton. I wondered if it indeed was an off Collins in the end. Boy, that's a tough spin move in a basket. Games, Huck, in four days to get an NCAA tournament bid. They were able to pull it off. Banked in on a smooth move by Goodwin, who's certainly been the hot hand. Obviously, anything is possible, and St. Louis proved that last season in the A-10 tournament. 
Collins on the drive, but a roll off the iron. Big rebound, good one, and one. Defensive rebounding guards in the nation. Now St. Louis looking like a team about to take command of this, and another and one. Of course, some high percentage shots. Well, they got French back after the early foul trouble. That three is on the money by Jimerson. Jimerson off the bench with 11. A talented three-point man. Going to bounce speed and a finish by Popovich. Points, 24 boards and seven blocks. Tipped away at midcourt. Nine on the shot clock. Collins with the feed and a stuff by French. First true road game of the season. Coach Ford was eager to see how that would play. The tip is going to be up and good by Popovich. Yeah, Virginia Tech looked really good in the Maui Gym Classic. Obviously, pulling off the upset of versus Michigan State versus Stephen F. Austin. Yep, going to have to come right back at it. Another very tough opponent. Perkins went for the stuff, but no. And it's stuffed back in by French. And St. Louis leads it 59 to 43. You talk about a recruiting trip. Well, you know, I think a lot of our viewers know that Travis Ford was a star at Kentucky and he went to a Final Four team. Hoping they still have time. Thornton to press it. Heron got it. Two pointer. This could get really interesting here. Thornton floating in. He'll kick the pass. They'll swing it up top. And it's good. The three pointer. To get into your offense quicker. Thorn on the baseline. Getting a shot in the air. Heron. Yes! He hits a three. Nice save by Heron, but he bounced it to Jacobs. Now it's knocked away. Gets free to Hamilton. He throws it away. Very costly turnover. St. Louis comes in, and they will earn a hard fought road victory. Great effort by both teams, but St. Louis, uh, too much in the second half.